19,215. The cup, 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 cup. So, Corey, it should be this one then. Oh, yeah, I need my big knife. Why am I doing this little tiny light? Cup, 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 cup. What will be the case hit in this? Presumably, either a Lemieux, Iserman, or Stutzel was the one. A Lafreniere 99 was another. What will be this one? I guess we will find out. Sorry about that, Corey. By the way, yeah, that might have confused a few of you guys. I said it did. I had to change it because we already had that group break. It literally does not do anything to your. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna put these over here because these things are gonna fall over. There we go. We've got for the Rangers 249 Panarin. Panarin 249. Hey, speaking of this guy, this is a solid one. 249 rookie auto patch for the Islanders, Ilya Sorokin. Mateo, the way you got to think about it is the bigger the gamble, the bigger the payoff. For example, this card alone is going to probably more than double that spot price. Sometimes it's worth it, sometimes it's not. We've got for the Chicago Blackhawks the 99, Pui Suter. We suitor. Lamp lighters for the LA Kings of Kaliev. LA Kings, Kaliev. Triple jersey to thirty five, Ekblad Huberto Barkov. Florida Panthers. 35. And we've got a Robertson 249 rookie class for Dallas. Two forty nine. Well, Sorokin's very nice. I like that start. I, I miss opening a lot of cup. <laughs> it is super fun. 249 Braden Shen for the Blues. Braden Shen, St. Louis Blues. We've got a rookie auto patch, Sharon Govich for the New Jersey Devils. 249 Sharon Govich. For the Red Wings, quad, or sorry, dual jersey, dual patch number 35, Dominic Hasek. That's a nice card. To 35, Dominic Hasek. John, this is 193. 
Just so you know, the number had to get switched. This is 193. Chemical composition. Kaliev for the LA Kings. Kaliev. Quad Rookie Foundations, Sharon Govich to 99. And we've got a Melnichuk 249 for the Sharks. Melnichuk. Yeah, 193 was what this was numbered. It just got switched to uh, 215. So there you go. For the avalanche of Nathan McKinnon. Colorado. Rookie Auto Patch at 249. Thurkoff for the Blue Jackets. Oh yeah, everyone has opinions on these things. This is like the like gambler's delight for products. <laughs> High ends are always never going to be worth it for a lot of people. But for a lot of other people, it's a fun thrill and gamble. Number 94, exquisite rookie auto patch, Bera Bonov for the Maple Leafs. Exquisite rookie auto patch. Another Lamp Lighters, and this one's pretty accurate from a couple nights ago, Ryan O'Reilly for the Blues. Golden, you got to stop collecting this guy. Come on, man. Ryan O'Reilly, Lamp Lighters. Quad Mem number to 49 Panarin for the Rangers. 49. And we've got a 249 Hagel for the Hawks. No competition. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, there's, there's positives and negatives, as I said, to doing, uh, to opening cup pins, obviously, and positive and negatives and buying it. Uh, Kay, I probably will in time, yes. I, I think the more realistic one, Kay, I think I'm going to try to do sooner is a two-boxer at, like, the $99 range. I feel like that'll be more easier to to do but eventually yeah you know fifty dollar breaks for cup tin I'm down if people like it for the Islanders 249 Barzel Barzel nice we got a rookie auto patch gold Number to 24, Hoaglander for Vancouver. So the, the difference with the eBay cherry picking thing, not that I'm saying it's wrong, you just don't have the shot at getting that massive card for insanely cheap. That is the biggest difference and I think why people also love opening cup. You would never get a 99 Caprizov for 
three hundred dollars. This it is a potential. Not gonna be easy. Not gonna lie. Ninety nine Pui Suter for the Hawks. That is, I think, how some people will look at it differently, right? Some people will be like, "Well, I don't care about that. My odds are not very good. Whatever it is." Some people look at that and go, "That's not bad." Ninety nine Pui Suter. Brilliance Auto for the Blue Jackets, Liam Foodie. I think what he means by that is that you can pick what you want. So you pick what you want to collect and you don't spend a lot of money. Nice. One of a one. Masterpieces printing plate for the Buffalo Sabres. Dylan Cousins. Buffalo Sabres, Dylan Cousins. That's sexy. And 249 Geeky for Carolina. Yeah, like... The thing is, if you're a collector that is only after one card, then obviously it makes sense to do it that way. Like, for example, for you, Thelonious, if you legitimately are only after Jason Robertson, and that's the only one card you want out of this, there is no point of you buying a group break, hoping to get Dallas, and hoping to get that card. Just buy the Robertson. That makes sense. But I also like the idea of that you could join a break, not buy a cup tin, you know, join five breaks essentially for the price of a cup tin, and you never know, you might end up with a Caprizov, a Stutzel, a Lafreniere, like something that you might not have ever had an opportunity to get out of one tin. That's the positive news. 249 for the Carolina Hurricanes, Sveshnikov. Dashnikov. Rookie auto patch to 249 Carlson for the Hawks. Or you might get the worst team five times. You absolutely correct. Oh, nice. A 99. Exquisite auto material. For the Rangers, Lafreniere. Lafreniere, 99, exquisite auto material. That's cool. 99. That's a beautiful looking card. We've got for the Minnesota Wild, Ryan Suter to 15 quad jersey auto. Out of 15, quad mem auto. Triple jersey for the Rangers, 35, Fox, Buchnevich, Panarin. And we've got for the Devils, 249, Kevin Ball. We've always had this debate, for example, and again, there is no right or wrong. Same thing when I do like two box breaks a cup, just say at 99 bucks, or a case at 299. There is going to be the people who sit there and say, I would rather get the case hit, guarantee at 300 bucks. And there's other people going, well, I like the cheaper price, and I might get the case hit for $99. There's no wrong way of how you enjoy or gamble or whatever you think about at the end of the day, like, I can tell you from my point of view, which is literally irrelevant to everyone else other than me, is I would prefer the $99 one because maybe we get the cup case hit out of the $99 one. So I know when people sit there and go, well, it's not a full case break, it's not the same. Well, it kind of is. And in my opinion, your odds actually might be better. But, yeah, all risk versus reward. And 
that everyone who uh, does the hobby does it differently. We have people who hate group breaks, we have people who love group breaks. We've got a Miro Heiskin in 249 for Dallas. Dallas. We've got another gold rookie auto patch. Morgan Geeky for Carolina. So no golds in the first two cases. Two golds in the third in the third one. Morgan Geeky to 24. That's a nice patch. Wow. That's a nice one too. Number to 35. Dual jersey, dual patch. Vasilevsky. To 35. Vasilevsky. That truly is just a floating head card, isn't it? The more you look at it, it's purely just a floating head. We've got for the Minnesota Wild, brilliant autograph, Ryan Suter. Ryan Suter. For the Chicago Blackhawks, Mitchell to 249. And that is a healthy finish. Two of ten NHL glory Cheevers for Boston. Two of ten Cheevers. Yeah.